Hey guys, it's Sick here, and welcome to Tomb Raider 1 to Free Remastered. For the record, not sponsored. I just really wanted to try this out. I'm not doing a full playthrough of the game because I've done a playthrough of Tomb Raider 1 to Free already. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to do, uh, as the title suggests, I'm going to play through Tomb Raider 1, 2, and 3. But the catch is, is that if I die, then I have to go to the next one. And obviously once Tomb Raider 3, I die in, then video's over. Uh, I'm not doing the tutorial, so, and I'm also not going to save whatsoever because there's no point. If I if I die, then that's it. Uh, I'm excited, honestly. And it's got the expansion stuff too. Oh, I am probably in my own time going to eventually have to 100% this. I looked at some of the achievements, and some of them seem brutal, like Tomb Raider 2 win without, like, complete the, the monastery level without a single monk dying. I don't know how that's even possible. Or, or another one where you get through the games without healing once. Ah, I get the feeling that they didn't remaster the, uh, these cuts. I don't think they they remastered the FMVs. No, I don't think they've remastered the FMVs. Fine. Yep, nope, they they don't. Okay, that's 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 a disappointment. That is a disappointment. I'm I'm sorry. I'm just I'm just I'm just thinking here. This would have been on a significantly lower resolution. Yeah, it's upscaled better than Metal Gear Solid is. Like, I don't know if... It, I, I'm just thinking to back when, like, I played Metal Gear Solid uh, 2. And, like, when it showed, like, it, like, the stuff in the codec, it was super pixely. But this... Like, this would have been, like, what, 480? And yet, this looks... it looks... yeah. And again, this is really weird. It's it's weird that they've, like, done these remasters. Like, like visually remastered it like this. With, like, a, a few small things granted. I'm just trying to get readjusted the controls. Like this, like, very smooth 60 frames a second. I can move the cam with the right stick. Oh, okay. That's cool. But, like, they... It, it's weird. They did all that, but they didn't decide to remaster the, uh... Like, I think I've even... I, I don't know if maybe that's just... Well, that's very Tomb Raider 4 style. Like, I, I don't know if they've, like, changed the animations a little bit there. Like, the way Laura climbed up there didn't seem... Or maybe it's just... Maybe they've, maybe they've put, like, some uh, interpolation in on the frames or something. But, like, it... It's weird. Actually, one second. I want to check something here. I'm not going to actually, I just want to see. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it, 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 they do have the, the save anywhere kind of deal. Cool, good to know. Uh, I'm a little bit taken back by uh, how smooth it all is. I know I could make the joke that I'm uh, distracted by uh, something a little bit, uh, how you say, yeah. Just trying to remind myself on where to go. Yeah, and it's down here. Yeah, like, I know it could be like, oh, I'm being distracted by this thing a little bit more uh, prominent, so you say. But no, genuinely, it's. Re I don't like the. I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't like that. Can I change that?
There we go, that's an indicator. See, I don't want that. It's how smooth the frame rate is. Now, maybe that's just me. It might be that I just struggle to see 60 frames. Because I, I play games that, that you know, say they go, they're running in 60 frames, but it doesn't feel this smooth. I don't know why. And I know it's not because, like, my PC's weak or anything. No, this is, this is using a 490. Is it 490? It's probably a 490. It, it's part of the... Or the 4090, even. It, it's part of the 4000 series. That's that's what I'm getting at here. I don't know. I, I feel... I feel... I have to check... Surprisingly, no jiggle physics. Give it, give it a few days. I bet you that. Uh... Oh, cool! I just got an achievement: defeat a wolf while you're both in the air. Actually, wait, I just realized. I wait. Hold on a sec. I just realized. Laura couldn't do that before, could she? Now, there was another thing as well. Hang on. What? Wait, why am I in controls? One sec. I'll try some here. Oh. Oh. Oh my god, they brought in the control. Wait, hold on. If I if I draw my weapon. Okay, I have to hold it. Don't like that. Can I manually aim? And then Oh, there's a camera mode. Uh, how do I? Okay. I don't know how I feel about this with my controls. Oh my! Oh, it's like Halo One and Two. Holy shit! Oh, and there's the choppy frame rate, I remember. Oh. Oh my god, this is a... FMVs aside, this is already an amazing port. So I've just realized a very small problem, actually, with that. Uh, if I want to pause, then I have to open my inventory. Otherwise, that. Okay. Odds are I'm probably not going to be uh, talking as much. Oh, well, not so much. I'm going to be talking. But I don't think people are going to be see. That was five shots. Am I imagining that? I, I could have sworn that doesn't do as much damage. Summon the bear. I'm pretty sure if I if it kills me, I get an achievement because it it stands up. And there was a there was something about ah, it's dead. Cool. Genuinely, I might completionist this game. Yeah, I mean, it's it's Tomb Raider. This was one of my, granted many, but it was one of my childhood games. Yes, even Tomb Raider 3. Because you know what? You want to know why 
Tomb Raider 3 is not going to be such a bitch and a half? Save anywhere. Unlimited saves. Tomb Raider 2 style of doing things. And I know the PC version of, two, uh, of the Tomb Raider games had that too. But, you know, I was playing it on the... Uh, not on the PlayStation version. Uh. Yeah, that's what I basically... It's... Don't get me wrong, Tomb Raider is still going to be bullshit. But at least I'll have unlimited... Oh, Tomb Raider 3 is going to be bullshit, I should say. What? But at least I'll have... God, I love... I, I... More remasters need to do this. God, I'm... I'm... Oh, God, it... Seriously, more remasters need to be need to be able to do this for like their older games. God, it's such a good feature to have. Oh, the skulls on the door! Oh, that actually, like that's super low poly, but that that definitely ups the creepiness for it. You know. I wonder. Okay, they still got the glitch in. That wasn't the exact glitch I was going for, but it's good to know that the two Raider glitches are still there. I forget what that glitch is called, but it's the one where you you, you, you stand on the very corner there and you, you warp up. I, I did it in Tomb Raider 2 because I was an idiot and didn't realize the uh, the way out and such. You know, that 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 one. Hmm. Well, that's a noticeable downgrade. One sec. I know there's an achievement for getting the shotgun before getting the any of the gears. So I'm going to see if I can... Because I think the shotgun's over here. Yeah, this would be faster using, like, the modern controls. I know I'm going in the wrong direction. But I could have sworn this leads me to something. Oh, it just leads me to that. Oh, there's a shotgun. Yep, let's get let's get a free and easy achievement. And then we're gonna have the most likely chance of me dying. There we go. What if I go this way without following the route? I forget. I mean, that's probably death. Oh, wait, what's this gonna... Because this, this used to not be able to... Uh, guys, I'm, I'm trying to... Uh, thank you. I know they do. I know they did it in anniversary, but it's great to see the vision, like, made in the original Tomb Raider. Yeah, I know that it's still showing that showing at night and such, but it just it feels nice, you know, that we get to see it how it was originally intended to be. Whoa! I thought you had died there because yeah, you did that. You did that animation. Okay. Well, here comes my biggest chance of death.
Oh, they got a health bar. Yeah, that's not in that ver yeah, that's not in this version. I'm not risking it. I don't I forget if it's an insta kill. You know, if you're just gonna get that close to me, I'm just gonna This doesn't necessarily bring a tear to my eye, but it makes me very happy to know that, again, like, there were, and I know, as I said, they did it in Tomb Raider Anniversary, but that was an anniversary thing, not the actual, like, it was a reimagining of the game. This is Tomb Raider 1. Yeah, sure, it's, you know... Sure, it's got all the, the fancy new, like, frame rate and everything, but I mean, just press start and... A remaster for modern hardware, you know? You don't need to worry about the really crappy DOS box version anymore. You don't need to, you know, emulate it anymore. I know I'm getting really sentimental. But you have no idea how happy this makes me. A small thing there, like the reflections hit. I am getting so like I don't cry. I rarely cry, but like this, this is kind of emotional. Honestly, hang on a second. I think I'm doing this wrong. Like, shit, man, all, all, all I did to, like, I, I just decided today, like, hey, you know, I'm gonna, I'm just gonna play through these games. You know, is this gonna be, like, several clips? I say several clips, I, I am, no doubt this is gonna be a long video. Like, there is, without a doubt... Now this is gonna be, I see a problem with the polygons. Like, those dark marks there, I don't think they're meant to be that like that. Like, it's clearly being used as the shadows. But that doesn't look right. Why why why'd you do that game? Why'd you why'd you why'd you knock me out of my uh my reminiscing and my appreciation for what you've done? Which don't go wrong. Really fucking appreciate. But there's a few weird things. You know? Again, the uh the absolute biggest one is uh, the, the fact that the 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 the, the uh, FMV cutscenes you know why are they uh oh that might kill me all oh, right yeah now you start with a shotgun i forgot okay this is a perfect place to do my little roll check if i did the jump right I'm going to get all the secrets in this level. Which means I could die getting the Jade Dragon. Please, eagles. No, okay. See, that's another one of the things I really love about the fact that I can switch between the two. I could just be like, wait, did it look like that? Oh yeah, so it did. I 
I guess I'm just confusing it with uh, with Tibats, because that did have eagles. Okay, yeah, 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 got it, got it, got it. Perform a swim salt dive into the water. Got it. Yeah. I was right. You can do that. It's just that you can only do it in Tomb Raider 2 onwards, which basically means if I want to get the, uh, because I think that's one where you do a double somersault dive. That's going to be difficult to do, come to think of it. Ah, god damn it. I completely forgot what the implications of this would mean. Well, if I get too scared, the game does have an arachnophobia mode. Yep, here I go. Uh -huh. I made it! Aha! That was literally the one thing that would have probably gotten me a uh, game over there. Ooh, oh, hey, buddy! I could have sworn you don't spawn right away, but I'm gonna just... Yep, good for you, pal. Ah. I mean, I got it. Might as well use it. Yeah, that's definitely so weird with the textures at that part of the leg. Like, is it meant to be that they're rolled up? It kind of just looks like scars. It's weird. To be honest, hope they kind of fix that. But I don't think they... I mean, there's... Okay, I mean, Laura didn't even have any of those for that. Okay, I mean, I guess it's what they had to work with. Still, though. Wait, what are these good? What's it? What's it? Are these? Are these gonna be? Rem these have to be remastered, right? Okay. Well. Cool. If that was just your way of trying the doors for me. Leave that gun on my gearing. Though not anymore. So after you. Sama. You don't behave like you got the monk's blood. I understand that somehow is in my favor. So indulge me about the dagger. I'd be indebted. What's wrong with her eyes, uh? These doors are waiting for the right one. The right time to arrive. And then the dagger's blade will honor the heart. I love how I can just swap these. Unless you pledge your loyalty as well. And which one is that? To the sin. Fortunes of, of Marco Bartoli. Perhaps not just yet, then. Oh, my God, they actually added that stuff. Oh my god, they actually... Oh. Again, it's weird. Like, there's some stuff for here where it's like, oh my god, that's, you know, really well done or stuff. And then there's one where it's like... Eh. Like, like the cutscenes. Like, like that cutscene there, it was... Okay? I guess? Like, there, there was just some parts of it there that were very... They could do with a patch to fix it. They, they could do with a patch to fix it, is, is what I'm saying. You know? Like with with Laura's eyes doing that. Uh -huh. 
Mm. That part needs work. That that part needs work. God, I really my like completionist this there's nearly 300 achievements. There's nearly 300 achievements and like a large amount of them oop, are going to involve the what's this do again? Ah, skipped a step. Or did a step out of order, I should say. Anyway. I, uh... Like it's, it's stuff like the, with the expansion packs. You know, Unfinished Business, Golden Mask, all that stuff. I ain't never played them, because I've only ever played the PlayStation version, which never... Well, I mean, I might have had them, but, you know, weren't on the disc. You'd have to probably buy an expansion disc or whatever. Was that even a thing? Could they even do that back then? I don't know why I'm saying this. I grew up during that period. But it's kind of... They must have. They must have. They, they had the tech. They have the tech. Final Fantasy made use of that kind of tech. As is tradition now for whenever I play Tomb Raider games. Uh, I am an hour and 20 minutes in. And I've done six levels. say, you know, and as always, I'm not saying it in a negative way, it's just, uh, hey, isn't this neat kind of deal, you know? And I think it also shows either, A, how much better I've gone at this game, B, uh -huh. how much more difficult Tomb Raider 3 is, or C, all of the above. Okay. Oop. Wow, that didn't... That that did not do a whole lot of damage, if I'm honest with you. I, I was expecting it to do more, but I guess not. Oh, bugger. Right! <laughs> This could potentially be the shortest one ever. Really, it depends. I mean, it's Tomb Raider 3. And what do I always say about Tomb Raider 3? Welcome to Tomb Raider 3. Fuck you. Wait, no. Wait, no, 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 no. That's, that's very good. I'm pretty sure there's a secret down here. No, there is not. At least I don't fit. Yes, no secret. That's the way I go back up. Right, I remember now. I wonder if that means that the MP5 is going to look like, you know, uh, like how the MP5 typically looks like now, like the SAS ones. I know, I know an MP5 is MP5, but it's like a certain kind of MP5. It's a, it's, it's a variant. That's the word I'm looking for. It's a variant. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay. Nailed it. That's definitely Deagle ammo. Is it still called the Deagle here? Yep, Desert Eagle. I guess... 
when I play through it on this, I'm actually going to finally get the grenade launcher. I'm still surprised how I went through the entirety of the game without finding the grenade launcher. If you ask me, that's very impressive. You know, it's occurred to me since I've, uh, since I was being all like, you know, once I die, that's it. Technically, when I die here, the video ends. So, uh, I think I'm going to make my, given that we're playing Tomb Raider 3 now and the chance of death is immensely high. Uh, I'm, I'm going to say now, uh, I am very happy with this remaster. It's not perfect. There's a lot of problems. Uh, for one thing, I think I think the game could have really benefited from uh, remastering the, the FMVs as well. Uh, I feel that the the actual in-game cutscenes do need a little bit of work. Hello, monkey. Uh, what else? Um, I mean, I... Nah, I was gonna say I don't like the whole fact that you can't... See, actually, that's one thing I want to check, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Good. Okay, I know what's gonna happen here. I think. Uh, I, I, yep, there it is. I adore the fact that you can, uh, switch between the two different modes. More games need that. The only, the only game I know that does that, that lets you freely switch, is... I was just guessing is a uh, Halo 1 and Halo 2 anniversary. They're the only ones that I know that let you do this kind of thing. More games need to have that if they're going to remaster. You know, just seamlessly switch between the two. Unless, of course, the remaster is so fundamentally different that you just can't. Do I want to go for that crystal? Potentially would result in my demise. Do I... Is what I'm thinking of doing really worth it? Kinda. But, yeah, I... I think this is a really good port. I... 